Lately, uh, self-care, meditation, uh, self-love are some of the hot topics that we are seeing all over on social media. In that sense, what tips you can give to job seekers, especially during the job search, you know that they are very stressful, they're applying or they're going to interviews and they are worried or they're afraid they cannot doing well and they're not getting the job. How can they use those techniques that I've mentioned and some of your techniques that I believe you also posted on your LinkedIn that job seekers can benefit? That's a great question. And so the average person breeds somewhere between 12 and 25 breaths per minute. Now that we are in a state of heightened anxiety and fear, and my guess is that the average person is upwards of 30, if not more breaths per mm-hmm. minute. So let's take that, for example, and let's make it real world applicable to anyone and everyone right now, not just people who are looking for jobs, right? So you take that, and when someone is seeking for a job, they're typically in that heightened state because they're typically coming from a place of scarcity where I need to have this job. If I don't have this job, I cannot survive. So you're in a fight or flight mode, which means that the omnigata in your brain is releasing chemicals in your body to give you that super strength, the mom that can pick up a car off of their baby, right? The unfortunate thing is that we don't need fight or flight 24 seven, but we're living in it 24 seven. So for your job seekers, what, what, what you can do before you walk into that interview is number one, you can set the intention that you're moving in from a place of love, not fear. Mm. Now, how do you do that? You're going to have to bring yourself down because you're in a heightened state. And the way that you can do that is simply by reducing those 12 to 25 breaths per minute mm-hmm. into half of that. So good example of doing that is literally set your watch, set your clock, set your phone for one minute and breathe. Inhale. Exhale. Mm, Yes. Now I take six breaths per minute. Now I've activated the vagus nerve in my brain. And that nerve is the nerve that's responsible for releasing the calming chemicals in your body. Now the vagus is is activated. You're calm. Now you walk into that room. Now you have your interview and you're from a steady state of love and calm versus elevated. Because guess what? You know how people say I can smell fear? Yeah. Well, you don't necessarily smell it, but you can feel it because the energy that we bring to the room Mm -hmm. precedes our body, precedes our thoughts, precedes our words. So you feel me before you ever see me. Yes. So how do you hedge your bets in your favor over the other candidates? Walk in from a state of love, walk in from a state of fear, stop, slow down and breathe. Now you're more able to articulate yourself. Now you're able to put your unique qualities on display. Mm -hmm. And now person on the other side of the table has no other choice but to hire you because you bring such a unique qualitative perspective that no one else has because you simply come from a place of calm everyone else is frazzled yeah i totally agree and thank you for sharing with that dylan and for the audience watching or listening if you have any other tips in terms of how self-care or medication can help job seeker please leave it leave a comment below Subscribe to the channel and tune in tomorrow for another question with Dylan.